and welcome back blah, welcome back folks welcome back to let's play Zelda a link to the past it has been a while since my last video since I recorded my last video um, it actually feels it feels good coming back to this game I say that and then this happens no it you stop it Oh, I can't kill him. Ugh. I hate this game. Okay. Stop it. Stop you fucking... Fucking piece of shit. I hate you. I hate this fucking game. So it feels good. It feels good coming back to this game. I lied. In fact, it does feel. Um, it does feel good coming back to this game, and I will be just a tad sad when this Let's Play uh, will be finished. So we are only three more dungeons to go. One of them being the Ice Dungeon, the most annoying one. Or at least that's, um, yeah, according to the popular opinion. This is actually the second time and hopefully the last time I'm recording this particular video because um, when I recorded this um, the first time, actually, my recording software um, didn't record the in-game audio. That's so the, I'm using um, Afterburner for this. The annoying thing about Afterburner is that it sort of um, automatically it automatically adjusts its audio settings whenever anything about your audio configuration changes. So when you um, insert a microphone, for, for example. Um, and you would have selected to record in-game audio, um, it would still automatically sometimes, yeah, um, go to, um, yeah, record, wait, that thing just stole my shield. Okay, that's that's annoying. I uh, didn't know that they would they can do that. Yeah. So after burner is a bit annoying. This regard. Okay. So I've already been here into this ice palace, so I actually know what is about to happen. What is about to happen is that the creature on the left, statue on the left, is going to come to life. And you have to kill it using the fire rod. Mr. Man, the magic flames will protect you inside this icy dungeon. Yeah. Um, the next room contains these, which I will not bother to kill with the bombers. Maybe I should have bothered to use the bombers. But that's really odd. That's really not nice that these pumpkins can steal your can steal your shield. I hope it doesn't despawn actually. That would be even worse. Okay. So now we first enter this room which contains uh, a lot of these I don't know, ducks maybe. Okay, these creatures that we have, I don't think, yet encountered. Um, yeah, they are most easily taken care by the bombers, and since they drop magic refill, it doesn't matter if you, um, yeah. And I didn't want to 
press this button actually. Yeah, the second. So there are two things that are annoying about the ice palace. One thing are icy floor tiles. The second annoying thing that is that this dungeon has seven lower floors. So we could be in this here for quite a while. And now comes a room that again contains uh, these strange duck creatures. I pressed the wrong button there. I pressed the wrong button again, in fact. Um, so they didn't drop... The last time they dropped um, a magic refill and actually, actually some health. And the next room is completely pointless. Um, unless I'm missing something, so... I suppose you enter this uh, from a lower floor and then get to... Um, get to... Yeah, open this crate. I don't think we can do anything about that right now. So this room is sort of pointless. Um, however, since now we've entered from the opposite side, we can push this to the left and enter this topmost floor, which again contains uh, some of these. This is. These are the wet runs, which um, if you attack them, spawn two smaller ones. Yeah, and then that happens. Yeah. 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 Actually, this, I I noticed uh, just recently that the Zappy attack um, only um, doesn't hurt you, but it just subtracts some, yeah, a bit of your magic. So now we have to use the bump to activate this switch there. And this is a bit buggy, yeah, this... Um, Collision detection, and then we have to break the floor. Preferably uh, without us being standing right next to the bomb. And now a skeleton is going to spawn. I said a, st a skeleton is going to spawn. Okay. Uh, that you can actually not destroy with your sword, but you have to use the bomb. Okay, a second one is going to spawn. Uh, yeah. This is, description box also says that you cannot destroy the skeleton knight with the sword alone. When he collapses, he is vulnerable to another weapon. That weapon is the bomb. The last time I took it took me the entire video just to get to this point. Now we've Still some seven minutes left. Um, okay. Careful here not to get hit. Ah. Hmm. Am I getting better this game or am I just lucky right now and this transport belt actually changes direction also another thing that I just no noticed right now is that um, these spikes yeah these spikes there I think this is actually the exact same texture that is used in the Mario games or at least in the Super Mario in Super Mario Maker And also this um, rotating 
yeah, beam of fiery balls can also be found in the, the Super Mario games, even though it's um, it's a bit different there. Ugh. Okay. And then, ugh. Okay, that was stupid. Okay, made it. Yes, yeah, so I know I'm quick save abusing. But I don't, I don't care. Okay. I. Ah, okay, this. Let's us go back. Um, yeah. Let's just deal with them the easy way. I think this bomb boss actually. Uh, they seem to just eliminate all creatures in one hit. In the independent of how much uh, hit points they actually have. Ugh. Hmm. Uh, wait, does my shield block? No, it does not actually block that. More breakable floor tiles. Hmm. Or are they breakable? Are they breakable? But again, I pressed the wrong button. Question Will I ever manage to rem remember the key bindings before I end this let's play? I think that remains to be seen. For now we are lacking a big key. Ugh. Do I actually want to bother with you? Maybe not. Hmm. Ugh. I hate this. I really hate this. Um, the skull that is surrounded by these um, um, yeah, four red dots. Okay. Let's just use the bomb boss this. Oh, we actually cannot. Uh, yeah, we can't. Just use the. Fuck no. Can't just use the bombos, unfortunately. Because that thing is, I think, invulnerable. This red thing. And we. Ah, oh, there's the switch. Need to activate the switch. While trying not to get hit by these bats. While not. While trying not to get hit by that. Rotating thing while trying not to get hit by that thing that follows you while trying not to get hit by uh, whatever and my time is up and I actually hmm, can only 
Uh, yeah. How do you actually solve this puzzle? Hmm. Stop following me. Okay, I didn't actually pick up the big key anyway. Um, hmm. Okay, at least this annoying beeping sound is gone. Yeah. But it's probably about to return very soon. Yeah. And so it was. And I think with this I shall end this this video and when we come back folks we will continue to explore the ice palace so until next time folks um till then